Remember to turn on all notifications so you don't miss a video. I dread talking to you people like J. Cole. Let's just get into it. I was inspired to record debates by Triggered Senpai, but I realized that my debates are simply not as entertaining as his. I don't know if it's his demeanor or the fact that he has a bunch of people talking in one call, but my debates were nowhere near as entertaining as that one blue lock debate I posted from his stream. My videos were boring to watch and they weren't enjoyable to make. It kind of felt like a chore. Compare my debates to my just chatting videos. Both are long conversations, but the latter is far more entertaining, and when I enjoy the video I'm making, the result is usually a higher quality video. One way to make a debate entertaining is to add toxicity, but I don't want to be toxic. One of my goals with the debates was to further validate my essays to my audience by taking down counter arguments. But after talking to one of my fans, shout out to Sweet Dude, I realized that I was thinking about it wrong. I thought that me losing a debate would increase my opponent's credibility and decrease my essay's credibility, while me winning debates would increase my essay's credibility and decrease my opponent's credibility. But Sweet Dude pointed out that me winning only decreases the credit of my opponent, it doesn't increase mine. I thought a lack of inconsistencies made my argument stronger, since inconsistencies would make an argument weaker, but an argument is supposed to be solid to begin with. It's like defending a title in boxing. You just keep the title when you win, you don't get an even higher title. So now I've lost one of my main reasons for making debate videos. If I make a video essay laying down all of my points, in the briefest and most detailed way possible, and someone comes to the comment section disagreeing with me, what are the chances that a debate will change their mind? Probably zero, because if they didn't agree with me in my prime, which is a video essay, there's no value a debate will offer. I debate to understand and have others understand me, but some people just debate to win. If I'm focusing on understanding and my opponent is focused on winning, then the debate will most likely go nowhere. The problem with my challenging strategy is that I ask people who are in the camp of already not understanding or disagreeing with my essay. So at the end of the day, I'm wasting my time because their objective is to prove me wrong, not to come to an understanding. You can see that play out in my second debate. In fact, if a person wants to debate me, it's likely that they aren't trying to understand what I'm saying, but prove me wrong, which will lead to me wasting my time if I engage. Additionally, I no longer care about trying to have everyone understand me. Those who understand will understand, and for those who don't, I don't really care. I already talked about why I did Cancer's comments and debates in my first debate video, but hindsight is 2020, and hindsight says debates are more tedious than Cancer's comments. I gotta schedule the debate, record it, and then pray that it's entertaining. Meanwhile, with CC, I choose interesting comments and I can record whenever. I want to educate people and myself on writing. Debating people on my videos isn't going to do that, especially if you already understand my points and agree with me. These debate videos are low effort, high runtime videos that can get a lot of traction, but I don't want to do that. I wouldn't want my favorite YouTubers to do that, so why would I? I feel like this could easily take over my channel and I don't feel satisfied with these videos and I probably wouldn't rewatch them. I want to keep making high quality, concise, and beneficial content. Content that is timeless. And if I ever do move away from writing videos, those new videos have to be entertaining and these debates just aren't. In conclusion, I'm canceling debates. I think I'm just going to go back to ignoring comments and making CCs every now and then. The just chatting videos where I hang out with the dogs will be a worthy replacement. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and help me revolutionize the manga industry by buying my manga and spreading the word. All important links will be in the description.